what's up everybody welcome to my channel and today in this video i'm gonna show you how you can fix cp button lagging on your pc while you're gaming or using your pc in daily task so guys make sure to watch my this whole video because in this video we are going to cover every single settings of your window for improving our cp performance and fixing 100 percent cp usage so without wasting any time let's go straight into our this video so guys this is the most important step you have to watch this whole video from start to the end therefore you can properly set up all the settings on your pc so guys in the first step we are going to create the best and the powerful power plan for our pc which will give the max performance and max power to our cpu therefore our cpu can perform better so how you can create a power plan you have to download a software link available down in the description simply open the link that will take you onto my this website you have to go into the search bar and search for the park control and download this free application on your pc now it is paid but if you download it from my link you will get it for free scroll all the way down click on this download button and download this software by clicking on this download button simply so once you download you have to simply install it it is really simple with just one click you can install it and after installation you have to open up power control on your pc you will get this kind of the interface and here you can check it out here my all the cores are right now active by default if you set your uh, this settings onto the balanced and if you apply it so here you can check it out here right now just eight core are working on my pc so now i'm gonna show you how you can utilize it for getting the 16 core or 16 thread keep working while you're gaming or using your pc according to your cpu so you have to go onto this drop down and set it on to the bit some higher performance disable all of the settings and set all of the sliders on to the 100 percent click on to the make activate for activating this power plan and this will unlock your all the core for the max performance now here is the option which is paid and if you use this application you will get it for free which is the bitsem dynamic boost enable you have to check mark here go for this drop down and set it on to the uh, bitsem highest performance click ok click ok again and the settings is now set up and this application will keep running in your background into the system tray whenever you turn on your pc and it is totally fine you have to keep running in your background so guys now the next step you have to disable high precision event timer which will also causing the high cpu usage so how you can do it you have to right click on your start icon on windows 10 or 11 go into the device manager and there you will find our system devices option you have to scroll down and here is your system devices scroll down and here is our high precision event timer right click here and you have to disable the device i have already disabled so therefore it is showing me enable device but you have to disable this device once you disable it now close out your device manager and now you need to go into your display settings of your windows 10 or windows 11 go into the related settings and uh, here you will find out this graphics tab go inside it go for the default settings and change default graphic settings and here is our hardware accelerated gpu scheduling you have to turn on this option therefore your gpu also work properly and help your cpu to perform better also so you have to turn on this option and if you not find it on your windows 10 so you can also simply go for your windows search and search for the hardware accelerated gpu scheduling you will find out the settings it is totally fine so once you're done and turn on the settings you have to now close out your this window settings and go into the directory of your game which you want to optimize for your cpu and for example i want to optimize my fortnite or valorant or gd5 you have to go into this directory so let me just open up my fortnite and uh, here is our uh, program file epic game fortnite fortnite game binary win 64 scroll down and find out exe file of your game whatever you are playing if you are playing fortnite go into your fortnite directory Go for the properties go for the compatibility check mark onto the disable full screen optimization then go for change high dpi also check mark onto the override high dpi scaling behavior click ok hit apply and click ok and do the same settings for all these exe file of your fortnite and if you want to go for your valorant so you have to go into your local dixie again go for the reward game valorant live shooter game binary win 64 and there you will find out exe file of your valorant you have to do the same thing go to the property go for the compatibility check mark onto the disable full screen optimization go for the change high dpi also check mark here click ok hit apply and click ok and close out your file explorer 
So guys, these are settings you have to use if you want to fix the CPU bottlenecking while you're gaming or using your PC. And I hope so, this will also help you to getting more performance out of your PC with your CPU. So please make sure to subscribe to my channel, turn on the bell notification, drop a like on this video and till the next video, peace out.